This local sports report is brought to you by Holistic Hockey, training and developing the whole athlete for the next level. Visit their website to learn more about semi-private skates. Also, sign up for Holistic's newsletter for all the latest information on programs. Check out holistichockey.ca. It was a Friday night battle in minor midget AAA hockey. The Kitchener Junior Rangers played host to the Chatham-Kent Cyclones at the Activa Sports Complex. First period, Chatham-Kent on the rush and Jacob Julian is in on a breakaway. His shot gets stopped but the rebound ends up in the net. Take another look though because it was directed in off a Cyclone player's glove so the goal did not count. We're still scoreless. Chatham Kent keeps the pressure up though. Aiden Blaine ends up with a good opportunity in the slot, but he gets stymied by the blocker of Dylan Grover. And the Kitchener netminder was not done there. A couple of minutes later, Cyclones on the rush. Denzel Aguilar gets a one-timer off, but it gets kicked away by Grover. A tough stop going against the grain there. Then, the Cyclones collect the puck in the neutral zone and Ryan Gagne is in on a break, but Grover flashes leather. He was a busy guy in the first period of this one. Here's another chance by Denzel Aguilar. This time he tries to go backhand, but Grover has an answer for that as well. Late in the first, Chatham Kent on the power play and finally they solve Grover. It's Ryan Gagne who slips it in. A nice selly from the Cyclones forward, his team led 1-0 after the first period. Second stanza now, just over a minute in, Kean Heron puts the puck on net and good things happen when you do that. He scores! We have a 1-1 game now. Back come the Cyclones though, and some pretty passing ends up with Trent Rickwood in the net, but not the puck. The Junior Rangers back the other way now. The point shot gets deflected right to Ben Habel, but he gets robbed point blank by Maddox Nazwaski to keep the game tied. Third period, just 15 seconds in, Ryan McKellar wrists one from the point and he scores. The Rangers take their first lead of the game early in the third period. A few minutes after that, the Rangers with some good zone pressure follow the bouncing puck because it ends up in the back of the net. Benjamin Habel is the one credited with the goal. Kitchener now with a two-goal cushion. Cyclones weren't going away though. Ryan Gagne leads the rush, stops up and finds Cameron Gardner in the slot, but Dylan Grover comes across to absorb the shot. Chatham Kent now on a power play late in the game. Denzel Aguilar finds the puck in front and he pots it. The Cyclones making things interesting down the stretch, but that's as close as they would come as the Kitchener Junior Rangers pick up the W in an exciting tilt. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.